It was the coolest place on the planet. Everyone was either finding themselves, having a party, or getting laid. Just a country boy looking to make good. But a few weeks, and it felt like home. I knew every street, every avenue, every blind alley. Over Ray's Auto Store. I had work, doing a little debt collection for the Carlotti brothers, or knocking out liquor stores. And if I needed more, all I had to do was head down to one of Joe's diners and take money off the racer boys. Or maybe hit one of the circuits. From New Jersey to Queens, from the Bronx down to the Battery, this was my patch. My backyard. So what had I done to deserve so much fun? Why was I the guy with all the luck? I'll tell you why. I was a wheel man, and I was the best. Get what you came for? Fucking move, kid! <laughs> Liquor stores, huh? That mean you're on your way up or your way down. Thanks a lot, kid. This is where I disappear.
Back home, Ray was the guy everyone wanted to be. Hit New York in 75, became a wheelman, then had a wipeout, never drove again. Made a living fixing cars and doing tune-ups when he wasn't losing at cards. I just fixed you up with a shot at the big time. Thanks, but no thanks. So keep working nickel and dime stores. I don't need your help, Ray. Hey man, Slink here. About that opportunity. There's a set of wheels to my name beached up in Hunts Point. Go collect it and fix it up. Consider this your interview. Then we'll talk some more. I want to show you how things work around here. This is where the magic happens. Up here is where we keep track of current vehicle conditions, like heat, damage, and any nitros you've got. Over here is where we deal with the vehicle characteristics, like handling, acceleration, and top speed. You also get the vehicle name here, and what you got to spend on it here. Right. Let's start by putting this heap of junk back together. Out on the street, you're gonna pick up some heat. I know you're good, but it will happen. So listen up. If you can make it back here without a tail, I can clean things up. Give it a try. Okay, good. So now we got something that's not gonna fall apart on you. I know Slink, though, and he's gonna wanna see a bit of style, too. So I got just what you need right here. Now, I got plenty of spare parts lying around, and since you caught me on a good day, you can have one for free. Okay, kid, that's enough. I got a business to run. You want more? Come back when it's not on the house. Okay, now for the fun part. Let's jazz these wheels up. Okay, kid, you can always change your mind later on. I also know a guy who does custom paint jobs, some real psychedelic stuff, but he's a...
You're gonna be doing plenty of work on plenty of cars in this garage. You can keep your wheels here, and I'll keep a log of the work you do. Hey, kid. Ray, good to see you, man. Slink. Yeah, <laughs> you got the golden touch, kid. These wheels are looking fly. Ray, do us the honors and wire up the CB. You bet. We gonna be talking on that? We gotta stay in touch for a little while, kid. See, I needs to know you got the expertise I'm requiring. Three of my guys have themselves speed guns yours truly procured from the city police. At first, you gotta hit 60. At the second, 70. And at the third, I wanna see you hit at least 100. You got the balls to do that, kid. giving me, kid. I want to see some more of what you got. Oh, and you can keep the wheels. Do what you like with them. Over. Okay, Slink, get in touch on a landline, huh? I'm gonna lose the set of dials. I feel like I'm in that convoy movie. Uh, over and out. Oh, God. 